Mr. Shah Khan, thank you for having us here. This, I don't even know what to call this. This is magnificent. This is called NFL in London, okay? Mm. The Jaguars in London. Okay. <laughs> I got you, I got you. That's how we roll. Okay, sir. <laughs> see you, sir. You doing okay? I feel blessed, man. Thank you. First of all, Mr. Shad Khan, thank you for having us here. This, I don't even know what to call this. This is magnificent. How you doing, sir? I am doing fabulous. This is called NFL in London, okay? Mm. The Jaguars in London. Okay. <laughs> I got you, I got you. That's how we roll. I hear you, man, I hear you. Mm -hmm. So you moved to America when you were 16 years old, mm -hmm. right? Your first job apparently was as a dishwasher. Yep. And um, you became a multi-billionaire. Now, I moved to America when I was 15. I was living in Nigeria. Yeah. My first job was as a dishwasher. Yeah. But that's where the similarities end. Because <laughs> well, I didn't become a billionaire, man. Well, where did I go wrong, no, sir? No, you didn't go wrong, OK? okay. Yeah, you went right. OK. OK, so definition of American dream isn't about money, mm. OK? I mean, that maybe is one component. It's what you're doing that you want to do. Correct. OK, and you as a human being, develop the strengths and uh, the experience that you want. You're here in yeah. the United Kingdom now. You're here in London. Jacksonville yeah. Jaguars have been here nine times. They yep. say that this is the Jacksonville Jaguars' second home. What are your future plans for the Jacksonville Jaguars here in the UK? Well, I mean, London is really a commitment for us. Mm. And, uh, you know, I'm excited to be back at Wembley. But for us, it's, uh, you know, it's a chance to really um, uh, be in London to grow our fan base and really uh, serve the Jaguar fans. In 2018, you were in talks to buy Wembley. Apparently, yep. that mm -hmm. you know didn't happen. Is there any still thought in your head about continuing with that? Well, uh, you know, I mean, there's been nothing since then. Yep. Uh, but uh, you know, I think right now we're here playing the game and we're gonna be here a couple of years from now, but you know, who knows, let's yeah. be honest. There was talk last year about the culture of Jacksonville mm -hmm. and it wasn't quite right there with the coach we had last mm -hmm. year. What makes you think Doug Peterson is gonna be the right guy leading your organization forward? And I have the utmost, uh, you know, faith and confidence in Doug. I think anybody who's won a Super Bowl, <laughs> you know, been there, done that, yep. and uh, that speaks volumes. And, uh, and I think you look at the progress we've made. Okay, I mean, uh, that we're in every game right till the bitter end to the last, last series, and you know, we're a very young team. You played football. I mean, we've got to learn to close the games out. Yes, and uh, uh, so we're right there, and I think that's the final step we have to take. But I mean, right now, you know, our commitment is obviously Jaguars playing in London and, uh, and really developing our fan base and winning some games. Thank you so much. <laughs> Hello, sir. Thank you so much. Thank man. you. Hey, good luck on yeah, Sunday. I'll see great. you out there. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yes, sir.